time capsule that was discovered behind the foundation stone in Nuffield building. As you can see, it's a rather unassuming lead pipe. We didn't know what would be inside it. And even if it was a time capsule, whether the contents would be in very good condition would have survived. So when we opened it and found all of the documents and items that we did, it was a brilliant surprise. Here's a booklet about the planned United Services Officers Club. As you can see, the edges have got really curled where it was stored in a pipe for so long. It includes plans of the building and architect's impressions. This is the order of proceedings for the foundation stone laying ceremony and the seating plan for the platform for where the guests sat. This is a half crown coin showing George VI, who was king at the time the foundation stone was laid in 1949. His daughter, Princess Elizabeth, opened the building in 1951. Um, shortly afterwards, um, George died and she became queen. Also in the time capsule was a list of the ground staff who looked after the United Services officers sports grounds. We have the head groundsman, the carpenter, the head gatekeeper, the assistant secretary and the groundsman. They've also included their signatures. There were two newspapers inside the time capsule, both dated the 9th of May 1949. So we found the Daily Graphic, which was a national paper that has a mention of Portsmouth. The second newspaper we found was a copy of the Times. All of the items were in fantastic condition, considering they'd been hidden away in a lead pipe for 74 years.